What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another My name is Jeff. reaction. Welcome back. Well, this is usually your Dylan day as well, but Tom McDonald just released a brand new song and I had to jump on it. You guys know me, Hangover Gang. What's going on you guys? We are back at it again with another Tom McDonald reaction. We are doing this. I cannot wait. I don't even want to waste too much time. I'm going to get into it. I don't even have any good words right now. Nothing. I want to dive into it. I hope you guys are having a good day, and if not, I hope I can bring some sort of positive light to your day, because guys, whatever's going on for you, whatever it may be, just remember that you are not alone. You are never alone. You're a warrior. You're a soldier. Stay strong. I believe in you, and if you need it, the comments are there for you to vent, or you can DM me personally on my socials, but you do got this. Bro fist. High five. You got this, guys. I know it's easier said than done, but you do got Hey, don't. Don't fall now. Easy, man. Easy. Now I can tell by his Facebook post that this one is going to get political, so I'm not even going to say anything. Let's dive in and watch as he rips off the bandaid and here we go with another can of worms. Only Tom. I love when he does this. Let's freaking go. Holy crap, so he's got two different versions of himself. I can already see as it pauses. Oh boy. I'm the one that you hate for making America great. And I'm the one who's trying to build back better. We ain't the same. Yeah, you're right. There's a difference. Y'all are woke and we're awake. What a joke. Does white privilege have something to say? Yo, president drove the country into the ground. The crime rate is through the roof. There ain't no jobs to be found. Inflation going up. My kids need food in their mouths. You put the fake news on every TV screen in my house. Hold up. Your president, a racist homophobic, tried to overthrow democracy and everybody knows it. He will never make America great again like the slogan. He a white supremacist. Just like all of you who voted that is not facts all you woke morons do is talk trash drag queens in classrooms hate anyone who's not black you're pro-white you know that's what the clan members are right you're anti-lgbtq then why are they always on your mind bro you're a boy you're a girl stop playing stupid you're screwing up the youth and all the children are our future you don't care about the kids look oh at all gosh. the school shootings you're pro-gun it's your fault stop making those excuses you think anyone who don't agree with you is just a bigot you're a fascist you're a nazi you're just mad because you triggered you're just jealous of the left because we're progressive and we're winning now i'm tripping that you won the election because you rigged it they put you on the left they put you on the right okay wait wait wait. i gotta pause i gotta pause before this chorus Holy crap. oh my god he went there again holy crap dude holy crap holy crap he went there he went there oh shit Oh shoot, bro! Straight f spitting facts, though. I'm just gonna say he's spitting facts. Agree to disagree all you want, but it is facts. He's going there again. I'm gonna get backlash even for agreeing with him. I, I get backlash every single time I post a new video of him. Whatever. I'm allowed to express my opinion, whether YouTube or woke culture likes it or not. And he is spitting facts. You, dude! Holy crap! I don't even want to waste any time on this at all. I'm just mind blown. He's going there. Shh. Won the election because you rigged it. They put you on the left. They put you on the right. They tell you what to hate. Then they tell you who to fight. Till you're screaming. Screaming. They put you on the right. They put you on the left. They tell you who to hate. They do anything to get you screaming. Screaming. President draining the swamp, we building walls. Your president opened the border for one and all. Now there's murderers and criminals evading the law. Walking right into America, our safety is gone. Well, my president ended pandemic, saved the economy, and introduced legislation fighting for our equality. His son smokes crack. I don't care about that, honestly. He's raising all our wages. He can't raise his children properly. You obviously pro-life. A woman's choice is your right. I feel like abortion is important, and you don't like. You're treating it like birth control. You're treating them like your wife. I said that all lives matter, and I also meant the born life you're so clever go ahead make your little memes while we're bringing home the soldiers who were in the middle east okay you brought the soldiers home but then you burnt the flag and took a knee and left the men who fought for all our freedom homeless on the street build back better there'll be violence and riots until you bible thumpers learn to fall in line and trust the science we ain't ever backing down from all you pedos and tyrants the right is fighting the system the left designed to divide us and that is clown talk all you got is mean tweets it's free speech call the cops dog you defunded the police this country will be better off without all you freaks this is america homie if you don't like it you can leave they put you on the Damn. left they put you on the right they okay again i'm gonna pause before the chorus 
freaking A. What do I say to this? What do I say? Holy crap. Oh my god. I will say, I I was going to say it in the last pause, but I'll say it in this one. I, I don't even want to stay paused for too long here. I feel like this isn't, I mean, obviously 100% you can tell it's Tom fighting Tom, but it's not literally Tom fighting Tom. He's, I mean, notice the sweaters, the blue and the red. Like, blue is the liberals and red is conservatives, and he's literally doing a symbolic battle. But like What we all do each and every single day, the liberals versus Republicans, the conservatives versus the Democrats, like... Th that that's what we sound like that's what we're doing to each other and he's also he's not just saying this is what we're doing to each other we look ridiculous by arguing but he's also trying to say that the system is rigged and that they're trying to get us to fight when we need to stop fighting each other quit fighting each other and realize that the government is not going to treat you we need to quit fighting each other and realize that the government hates us no matter what they don't love you they don't we don't have to agree on a president, but just agree that the system is messed up whether you like it or not. And we all need to get on the same side and agree that the system is just messed up. That's all there is to it. To some extent, I love this. I feel like he's trolling the left, but on another hand, I know him better than that. He's really, he, he's strongly in the middle. He doesn't, he's not Republican or liberal. And he said that in his, in his other song, The Machine. I'm not Republican or liberal, but I took the red pill because that's who's fighting for my freedom. And that's truth. Sorry. That's how it is right now. Like, what, Regardless where you are in the spectrum, you can have your opinions and your ideals and your moral ground. But right now, the right is the right side to go on. The right is who's fighting for this country's freedom. The system is messed up. To some extent, I have always wanted to say that I agree with liberals, but right now, our country is so messed up, we need somebody to save it, and that ain't it. The right's got the right idea right now. Sorry, not sorry. People need to wake up, regardless of whether you like Trump or not, people need to just wake the frick up and say, this system is messed up, our government is messed up. It's time for a fix, it's time for a change. Again, none of that matters. I mean, you're free to, choose a president as you will but you gotta admit something's not right and we need we need, yeah i'm done re repeating myself i do get the general thing what he's trying to say like he's showing us arguing and how stupid we look but at the same time there's some truth to it like we need to stop arguing amongst ourselves and be a country again and actually compromise somewhere so we can take our country back because love it or hate it disagree to disagree our country is messed up right now and we need to fix things and not the way the woke culture wants to fix it. We need to go back the other way. The right makes sense. It just does. Sorry. America, homie, if you don't like it, you can leave. Yep. They put you on the left, they put you on the right. They tell you what to hate, then they tell you who to fight. Till you're screaming. You. Screaming. You. They put you on the right, they put you on the left. They tell you who to hate, they do anything to get you. President will ever give a damn about the truth. It don't matter who's the winner, cause the people always lose. No president will ever break the system from inside. It's a deep state plan dividing us into sides. It don't matter if you're left, right, black, white, red, blue, conservative or liberal, rich, poor, me, you, Republican or Democrat, old, young, mean, cool. They promise us our freedom, but then all we get is free doom. They put you on the left, they put you on the right. They tell you what to hate, then they tell you who to fight. Till you're screaming. On the right, they put you on the left. They tell you who to hate. They do anything to get you screaming, screaming. Bro, he went there, and I have nothing but respect for it as usual. Absolutely insane. Well done, Tom, and well done, Nova, as usual. The ultimate. Right now, the ultimate, the biggest internet duo there could be. Getting getting involved in politics and screaming the truth. And making a kick <laughs> video in the process. There's nothing really better to say about it. Oh, I like this first comment. So what do, It's from Tom himself. He pinned the comment. So what do y'all think? Download on iTunes and maybe we can take number one from Eminem? I wouldn't be opposed to that. I love Eminem. He's my, he, I grew up listening to him. 
but the dude's gone woke. I would not mind taking the number one spot from him. Tom's my new favorite rapper right now, honestly. Eminem was my childhood, but he went woke. I love, I do like the new song Houdini. I will say that I do like that. But if we, I would not be mad if we took the number one spot from him. I'll just say that. Tom has returned once again to be the voice of the people who can't speak loud enough themselves. It shouldn't be me versus you. It should be us versus them. Thank you to that comment, GOT Games. You said it. It, it, we need to stop this me versus you. We need, we the people need to stop arguing with each other and fight them. Quit freaking listening to their tricks in the media. Quit listening to the garbage that they're spewing. It's all fake. It's all garbage just to get us to be divided. Enough is enough, people. Wake up. It doesn't matter if we agree or not. Whatever you want to talk about, all that's out of the bag. Enough. This country is a mess and we need to fix it. It doesn't matter who you like as president, Biden or Trump, doesn't matter. Stop arguing. Just stop altogether. You're free to have your opinion, 100%. If you like Biden, you like Biden. If you like Trump, you like Trump. Qu whatever. Like, to each throne, everybody's allowed to have their opinion. But that's not what the message of this song is. And everybody needs, whether you love Tom or hate him, I, I personally like Tom, but it None of that matters. Like, really, the message in itself is the same. We as a country need to stop being divided. We need to stop arguing this ridiculous, endless bickering. And like Tom said, I hate you. Enough is enough. I need to shut up. I can go on and on about this all day. But good song either way. D killed it as always. There's, there's no better way to say it. He just killed it as usual. Holy frick. I love every time he does it. I mean, he's a good rapper in general. The songs are always good, but when he goes political and just speaking the truth, he just... What more do you say? I, pfft, dude, I'm... You guys in the comments, let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so very much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, remember... My name is Jeff. Pef Chunkies Unite. And I'll see you guys tomorrow as always. Love, peace, and chicken grease. You guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic night.